we do hard work and anything we can do to find avenues for leaders in healthcare to recharge and rejuvenate themselves so they can be better uh, in their personal life, better in their professional life, and be better leaders is an investment that you have to make. You get real um, hands-on attention and they really dig deep into you specifically with very hands-on tools and actions you can take home with you to make a difference in your life, both work and home environment. Well, I tell you, I think it is a breath of fresh air in that the whole burnout thing has got a lot of press. I think uh, no one's really found the answer, and I think they focus on the wrong things. I think this program, and I'm really uh, kudos to the AHA for recognizing that and bringing it to uh, as many of us in the healthcare profession as possible. I was hopeless three days ago, so I am hopeful that I can make a difference in myself. Take a chance. Um, risk finding out a little bit more about yourself. It's worth an investment to actually pause long enough to seriously ask yourself, are you doing as well as you could be? And what things could you find and what things could you then change to be a better person? No doubts, girl. We, we all have a, a zone of discomfort. And I can just tell you something you already know there's no growth until you leave your comfort zone.